Let's see an intriguing diagram that gives us five formulas for pi. Start with a rectangle with dimensions 2 by 3. Inside the rectangle, draw this triangle as shown here. The two highlighted pink triangles are both 1 by 2 right triangles, so they're congruent. Because they fit together at complementary angles, that means that the blue shaded triangle is a right triangle. The hypotenuses on the pink triangles are equal, and that means that the blue triangle has two sides of equal length. Therefore, the blue triangle is a right isosceles triangle, so the other two angles are both pi over 4. The pi over 4 angle on the left of this diagram can be obtained as the sum of two angles from these pictured triangles. One of them has an angle of arctangent 1 3rd, and the other one has an angle of arctangent 1 half. The upper right pi over 4 angle can be obtained as the difference of two angles, one in this triangle, which has an angle measurement of arctangent 3, and one in this triangle, which has an angle measurement of arctangent of a half. Another way to get pi over 4 in this case is as the difference of two angles in these triangles, one with an angle measurement of arctangent of 2, and the other one with an angle measurement of the arctangent of 1 3rd. The angle in the upper right corner of the rectangle is pi over 2, and this can be obtained as the sum of three angles, where one of them is the angle measurement of the blue triangle, which is arctangent 1, the next is the arctangent of 1 half in this yellow triangle, and the last is the arctangent of 1 3rd in this yellow triangle. Finally, the angle on the left side of the diagram pictured here is pi, and it's the sum of three angles in three triangles. The blue triangle gives us an angle measurement of arctangent 1, the bottom yellow triangle here gives us an angle measurement of arctangent 2, and the top yellow triangle here gives us an angle measurement arctangent 3. This amazing diagram has given us five formulas for pi. Let me know in the comments which of these five you like the best. And check out my pi playlist for other videos and animations related to the circle constant.